Hi, this is Riyash. Welcome to my channel. So uh, this video is going to tell you what is the correct uh, WD GANs uh, learning path. A uh, lot of people uh, keep asking me questions that, uh, yes, Riyash, what is the WD GAN? Okay. Uh, is square of 9 a WD GAN? Is squares in a WD GAN? Is wheel of 24 a WD GAN? Okay. What are the different type of cycles? Where do I start in the journey? I want to learn. Okay. But they don't know where to start. So this video is uh, going to answer all of your questions. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed to my videos, uh, my channel, uh, please subscribe it now so that you get all my uh, learnings. Okay. So we are not going to talk here who is WD GAN, okay? So there is lot of information available on the uh, internet. You can just uh, Google what WD GAN was doing. Okay, there is a lot of information out there, but let's see where to start, where to start learning, what is, okay, so, so there are uh, diff two different types of uh, GAN systems, okay, the first one is the planetary system, as the name suggests, it's, uh, uh, some planets are involved in this. Okay, uh, and the second one is the law of vibration system or we call it as a LOB system. So these are totally different systems. A planetary system as I said, the planets are involved and the law of vibration system it's purely the numbers. There are no, no planets involved in this. Okay, uh, it's a very, uh, LOB system is very advanced type of uh, system okay so the different type of planetary cycles first planetary cycle which is very basic uh, which is uh, the lunar cycle and all the forecast i do for the dow jones and nifty 50 on my youtube channel every month i do the, those forecast for free and that is done using the lunar cycle okay and as as it suggests the lunar it's the moon is involved in it okay and there are uh, the other cycles planetary cycles which are little bit advanced than the lunar cycle uh, the first one is uh, those are those uh, cycles are called as cor cycles or it's it's the cycle of repetition okay and there are three types of uh, cor cycles first one is mary the angel of mercy which uh, in short we called as a ma'am the second one is tokyo j1 and then uh, the third one is saint mary okay uh, in short we called it say it as the stm and the last type of uh, cycle is planetary cycle is the lone aviator uh, so the, this lone aviator cycle is uh, pivots faster than the lunar cycle this lunar cycle pivots uh, four to five times in a month okay cor cycle pivots two to three times on an average in a month and the low navigator cycle pivots seven to two, eight times in a month. So the low navigator cycle is used to time the time the entry and exit from the market. Okay. So the lunar cycle is the geocentric cycles, and the other cycles like COR cycles and the low navigator those are the heliocentric cycles. And out of these three COR cycles, one will be the dominant cycle in your stock or commodity. For example, the uh, for Nifty 50, which I trade, the MAM is the dominant cycle. Okay. Uh, gold or silver, 
metals. If you are trading in that, then Tokyo J1 is the dominant cycle in that. And St. Mary is dominant in IBM. Okay. And the other uh, question people normally ask me that, hey, hey you say you said that these are the planetary cycles. Too. So do I need to be an astrologer? Do I need to study the astrology? Okay. So the answer is no. I myself is not an astrologer. Okay. So what you need only uh, is that the ephemeris. So if you don't know what is the ephemeris, so ephemeris is the table of planetary positions. Okay. Uh, there are uh, different software tools available. Uh, you can even download it online, the, uh, the ephemeris and just you have to download it in uh, uh, Excel sheet and then work on it to get the cycles. Okay. So only thing is uh, you will need is the ephemeris and then Microsoft Excel. Okay. If you have those two things, you don't need anything apart, apart from this. And of course, you need the correct cycle lens and other things, okay? You need to know the internal mechanics of all these cycles. Okay, so uh, the other cycles are the LOV cycles. And as, as I said, these are purely numbers. So these cycles are one of the, uh, these are the examples of the cycles. There are more, more cycles, okay? Uh, so I am not listing all of the cycles. So the first one is the Robert Gordon seven days, which we called it as uh, RG7. Then Kidki, which is KK. Then the next one is the Jonah. Uh, then Sunshine Special. Then something called as positive, negative and neutral. Okay. So this positive negative neutral it works with jonah okay neutral is jonah and there are two more cycles like positive and negative okay. and the another question uh, people ask me uh, if these are not the uh, planetary cycles planets are not involved in it okay so how to get these cycles working for this you need a couple of things the first one is that you need the understanding of the musical octaves that is Do, Re, Mi, Fa, So, La, Ti, Do. Okay, that is a musical octave. You need a little bit of knowledge of that those octaves. And then uh, you need something called as the master time factor. Okay. So these two things uh, you need to uh, get the LOV cycles working. Okay, so I will give you an example of Robert Gordon seven days uh, in this video. Okay, so keep watching this video till the end. Uh, moving on to the uh, next uh, one. Uh, People always ask me, you know, what is how you can forecast the uh, prices, okay? Uh, people normally know uh, WD GAN used to forecast the uh, prices also, okay, for all the cycles. So there are uh, different types of uh, price system. Uh, the angle of repetition, AOR stands for angle of repetition, okay? and wheel of 12 or 24 this is the uh, system it works with the lunar cycle okay. uh, the cor cycles for the cor cycles the price system is square of 90 square of 144 and square of 104 that is also square of 52 okay And the uh, price system for LOV cycles is square of nine. 
and all this price system works okay uh, for those are uh, all high low high low you will be able able to uh, exactly forecast the price also okay so i have seen there are a lot of uh, websites a lot of people you know they teach square of nine they call it as the wd gan system I have also seen they are selling just the square of nine for five thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars. Okay, but that is not going to work for you unless you know what is Robert Gordon seven days. Okay, the LOV system. If you do not know the cycle, how are you going to use the square of nine, right? So the cycles are important than price. Okay. If you don't have the correct time cycles, you cannot get the uh, WD GANs price system working. No. I haven't seen anybody individually for uh, forecasting without time cycles the price. Okay. Let's move on. So the final question the people ask me, uh, where do uh, I start? Where do I learn all those cycles? Where did Mr. Gan uh, coded all his cycles? The answer is, it's, it is in the Gan's book, Tunnel Through the Air. You don't need any other book to decode all the cycles. Okay. Uh, as I said, whatever forecast I do, the monthly forecast on my YouTube channel, all those videos like monthly forecast, that is very, very basic uh, lunar cycle system. Okay. And the Robert Gordon seven days is uh, uh, the LOV system. So I'm going to show you an example of it. Okay. I do not forecast this uh, publicly, but I just wanted to give you some uh, highlights of it how uh, these cycles work and why we need this uh, LOV system this is very advanced uh, cycles okay <clears throat> you can note down these dates for the Dow Jones okay 23rd of August was forecasted as a high 28th of September as a low 15th of November 2022 as a high 28th of December as a low and 7th February 2023 as a high. Okay, just pause this video here and note down all these dates. Okay, and then we are going to go to the chart and see what happened here. Okay, and why these are important. And uh, okay, so let me bring up the chart. Okay, this is uh, Dow Jones, okay? Uh, so, um, what I publicly forecast is these, these dates. This is the lunar cycle, like 7th of uh, August is low, 14th August is high, then 21st low, then uh, 26th is as a high, then September 2nd low, and so on, okay? So, let's see, uh, let me mark uh, the Robert Gordon seven days uh, cycle, okay, here. Uh, so 23rd of August as a high and 28th of September is a low. So 26th and, okay, we can take that and then this is, this is 27th of September, we take that, okay. So, these two are the dates then the, our next day is 15th of november okay so november is here this is 11th of november yeah, let's take that the more the uh, larger the cycle is is this the more is the orb okay now for this lunar cycle plus or minus two days is the orb but for some of these Robert Gordon seven days notes, it can be up to uh, five to six days of orb, 
okay so we will have to consider that also so the next day is, is uh, 15th of november it's done then the next day uh, date is 28th of december okay 28th of december 2022 so this is 16th and then this is 28th okay this is 28th and then the next date is 7th of february okay so this is 9th of february okay <clears throat> let me minimize this try to okay. <clears throat> so to get that robert why this why this uh, robert gordon seven days or the uh, lov cycles are more powerful than planetary because there are some patterns okay see, see, see this particular mu it started on August 26th high and low is on 27th of September. Okay, it's one one month move almost. Okay, so this this one month move. Have you see here how sharp the market moved down? Okay, and then from. September last week till mid of November. You see how this this is this is again sharp high move. Markets went uh, higher sharply here, right? Then the next two moves till the last week of December. It's it's kind of a sideways move. Then again a sideways move till uh, uh, first week of February okay so whenever these moves repeat again okay so whenever these pivots repeat again you are again going to see the sharp moves like this and this is going to be a sideways move like this okay <clears throat> so the conclusion is you know whenever this move repeats again you are again going to get a sharp down move or up move it depends on your previous pivot okay again here you are going to get a sharp move again you are going to get a sideways move here okay and this is uh, you can see it's a uh, december january uh, new year um, uh, year in period so when i see a uh, moves going like this like sideways move People normally the WD GANs uh, system, you know, those who know, those people go on a vacation or they do something else. We don't want to trade these moves, okay? Because when this repeats again, it's you are again going to see a sideways move. So you know <clears throat> that whenever this repeats, it's going to be a sideways move. And these two are going to be sharp moves. So I normally trade only these moves i don't trade these moves okay so this is called as a pattern this pattern is going to repeat again whenever it repeats okay and the uh, traders who know this gan system this lov system they know in advance when you are going to get this this type of sharp moves again Okay, and this type of sideways, when the market is going to be sideways. Okay, when the market is sideways, you can do something else, uh, stop trading. Because you're not going to earn much money, the market is going to remain choppy and sideways here. Okay. Even you can see this, 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 the, the other cycle, like our lunar cycle also works, right? This is a high, this is low, high, low, high, low, okay? But since the Robert Gordon is going to tell you that I'm going down and I'm going to give you the sharp downward moves, whenever I trade this, this particular move, I'm not going to go long from September 2nd to September 8th, okay? I'm only going to short whenever I get a high, 
right i will short here on 26th of uh, august i will short here on september 8th i will short on september 22nd 21st right just think about this okay this is called as a pattern this pattern is going to repeat and it repeats only thing is that you you need to know in advance when this is going to repeat okay for that you will have to study the robert gordon seven days the lov cycles okay another question people ask me you know uh, why to trade uh, learn uh, why to invest so much of time and money in learning and wt gan system what he was why he was so special okay so where are his uh, trading records so these are some of these trading records you can find these records on the google okay on the internet so these trading records are audited by the independent third party okay so you can see the wd gans trading records for 1933 from august 1st to december 31st okay total number of trades 135 out of which 112 showed profits 23 in losses percentage of accuracy on the total number of trades is 83% percent. percentage of profit on losses is 89.9% total number of trades for the entire year of 1933 is 479 trades out of which 422 were profits and 57 showed losses percentage of accuracy is 88.1 percentage of profit on capital use 4000 percent or 40 to 1 so this is a mind blog blogging profit right uh, if he starts trading uh, with the capital of thousand dollars he will end up making forty thousand dollars right trading record for 1934 from january 1st to december 31st total number of trades 362 <clears throat> cotton 147 trades out of which 135 showed profits and 12 losses. Grain 170 trades out of which 161 showed profits 9 losses. Rubber 23 trades out of which 21 showed profits and 12 and 2 losses. Silver 7 trades out of 7, 7 are in profits, 0 losses. Silk 4 trades out of which three profit one is in loss stocks 11 trades out of which 10 are profit one is in loss so total for the year 362 trades out of which 337 showed profits 25 losses percentage of accuracy on the total number of trades is 93 percent okay percentage of profits to losses 93 percent again Prof percentage of profits on capital used is 800 percent okay similarly you can read the trading record for 1935 also okay <clears throat> so this is the reason you need to spend your time to learn wd gan system so another pe uh, question people may ask of the, like how much time is needed to uh, learn this system okay so the answer is it depends on the person's vibration this all system needs to be learned at a specific vibration okay some people get it working within one month some take six months some takes a year about a year okay it's a, so it depends on uh, individual how much efforts that you are putting to learn this system okay. so how can uh, anyone learn this uh, this system okay 
so the details are provided here on your screen you can pause here note down you can go to our website all the details will be provided there you can if you have any other questions other than what we discussed today you can contact us on uh, on with our email okay See you in the next video. Thank you.